hello guys so we are on new topic and this topic uh, will be doing search data by its id from the database using php mysql okay to hum log isme data search kar rahe hain by id ke zariye theek hai to hum log shuru karenge to yahan तो शुरू करने से पहले जैसे हमेशा कहता हूँ प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब करें लाइक करें शेयर करें और बताइए ठीक है तो हम शुरू करते हैं यहाँ पे ना हिस्ट्री मन फॉर्म्स जैसे होता है टी आई टी एल टाइटल इसमें देंगे सर्च डेटा वाई एच आई डी ओके सर बॉडी या इसको हम सेंटर में रखेंगे जो फॉर्म है हमारा ओके सेंटर एंड हम लोग यहाँ से शुरू करते हैं तो इसमें और सर्च फॉर सिंगल डेटा डेटा और रेकॉर्ड ओके फ्रॉम डेटा बेस यूजिंग एच पी फाइन या ओके और यू मेट से रिट्रीव सर्च फिच एच डेटा फ्रॉम डेटा बेस ओके सो दिस इज डन एंड नाउ लाइक इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डन exactly same form design will do it okay so i am cut cut copy paste the styles first will be the container okay this will be clear okay so now we will create a form a form form action and method is equal to first fine post first Okay, now here will be the our fields like text box input so type text name you have to give it as id because we will be retrieving through this name text box id our data okay so we'll give a placeholder place placeholder is equal to enter uh, emp id or student id whatever student id fine yeah done so now we will create one more input which will be for button okay we will give input type submit and name will be search c a r c h search and value is equal to c a r c h search by id fine these are value in my last previous video i have declared that table and all so you can see through it and learn how to create table so i'll just uh, copy paste it so it will be easy to understand these are table so now we'll be entering this so i have copy paste this so we need just this table row okay that we mentioned here over here fine 
now we are will be doing the php code okay it's like same like previous video for search itself so but little changes are there because we have included one text box and a button so we'll give a connection for this dollar connection is equal to mysqli connect then my local host local host comma my username i don't have so i kept root i don't have password so i just leave it empty and i give my database connection db is equal to mysql i select db then this connection is given as i have taught you in previous video please go and check out my previous video and here will be the database 338 inc this is my database name so now here we'll declare a if state okay so is set like my previous okay set post of what we should give here we should give a search that button it should search the value from the database okay by its id so search now we'll declare curly open the curly braces now we have giving dollar id so this will be our this name and your database name id id both should be exactly same okay so dollar id of dollar post of now we are posting this id okay this id and database id so the id okay now it's done so now the same query what we have declared in last video so select star from my table name is employee so here is the changes are like where where you have to select the id is equal to single quotes dollar id this will declare so it will fetch the data from according to its id now query to run this statement you have to make it query run is equal to mysqli query and connection you know right how to do this connection connection dollar q e r y query okay this is this connection is from this and this two databases see this this and this this query is from here okay a query either see are okay so हम इसको अब नेक्स्ट करते हैं अब सर्च करने के लिए हमेशा वाइल लूप यूज करते हैं तो वाइल लूप डिक्लेयर करिए वाइल सो हम डॉलर रो लेते हैं क्योंकि रो ही डिक्लेयर करना रहता है मुझे मुझे रो कंफर्टेबल पड़ता है सो आई लाइक टू कंफर्टेबल विद रो इट्स सो आई डिक्लेयर डॉलर रो एंड देन व्हाट शुड बी फेस्ट इन दैट फेट अंडरस्कोर अरे सो दिस इज द फंक्शन इन बिल्ट सो नाउ according to this what it should fetch this this statement so this statement will fetch this query run okay this query will run will fetch this dollar query where it is mentioned here okay so just paste it here control v and give enter now your while loop opens okay so here to we are inserting in html forms like our previous video okay so we'll close this php over here hmm. then we'll again open the php and here it's not closed so let's close it okay php is closed now over here we'll start the code for the html tags okay last previous video i have done it so here we are going to declare the table row and 
in the table row okay tr right then declare td td then start with end with td okay now in this is the php start php end so this value echo dollar row of f name i am giving so so this f name is from my database like wait i uh, i'll show you this into my database so this is my this name is there i'll go to my database and this is my local server local host bam server so i'll check my database i have given 338 inc database table name is employee see here f name l name email password father name address and phone number so these all details will be retrieved by its id okay so let's go back so i'll declare this as like copy this okay so paste it so i have fit some fields over here let's check out this will be f name uh, the email password then father name uh, address and one more field that was phone number okay so we have to add phone so these things are declared under this okay so it's not complete let's check out the code for this uh, let's run localhost then demo my folder name inside that folder i have given uh, what i saved the name is search data.php so it's my here search data.php it's not looking good so let's design that yeah so let's design over here so style like i have copied the code before itself hmm. so let's check out for this this is the code body table td so it should mention correctly see its table is not designed so for that i have given the table border width you can check out my previous video i have explained this very well okay let's check out now so this is the style uh, this button is not i think we have not declared the class for this okay btn is given here so let's go down oh, this is the button fine class is equals to btn will give and uh, will give both okay button and text will give the same design fine let's check out yeah now we are checking the id we are checking here the record by its id so let's go to database here see this is my database employee and this is my, my ids okay one two three four data fields i have entered it so let's check out first is with nandan own web designer fine we'll check out so i'll enter id one okay search by id okay fine see it now with with at gmail.com one two three four let's check out the answer with yeah it's correct so let's go with id4 search by its id yeah now the values are retrieved so this is all about searching by its id hum log search id ke zariye kar sakte hain okay so iska bhi aur bhi hai like how to search the data in text box jo maine next video mein kiya hai okay how to retrieve the data in text boxes and update it update it later video mein rahega 
लेकिन फर्स्ट हम लोग रिट्रीविंग टेक्स्ट बॉक्स करेंगे हम लोग ठीक है बाइट्स आई ठीक है नो रिट्रीव सच वैल्यूज इन टेक्स्ट बॉक्सेस ओके सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट आर ओके थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब एस शेयर एस लाइक एस ओके एंड प्लीज सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर टू योर फ्रेंड्स एंड लेट देम ऑल्सो सब्सक्राइब फॉर मी थैंक यू